Welcome back. The view of the Sun Coast is nothing without its equally gorgeous homes. But just like the tides of our beaches, the market can come and go for real estate. That's why we've invited realtor Andrew Haddad to explain the recent market findings. Welcome back, Andrew. Thank you. Glad to be here. We like when you bring us this information Absolutely. and remind us where this all of these findings come from. Absolutely. So we put, put together a market report every quarter. Now, the Board of Realtors, they actually produce countywide statistics. Yet that could be a little bit misleading because things down in North Florida are different from Sarasota and downtown. So what we've done is... With the uh, Zargarmi report, we've broken Sarasota up into different zones. And the reason we've done that is the buyers that are looking for condos, vacation condos on Siesta Key, well, the market's very different out on the keys as it is in central Sarasota or even Lakewood Ranch. So today we're actually going to take a, a deep, detailed look at what's happening in the different zones because knowledge is power. And I'm going to share with you the overall market. Really, I mean, there is definitely signs of a shift in the market. Oh, great. And, you know... My, my job isn't to bring all great news, it's to bring Real accurate news. news. Yeah. Absolutely, absolutely. So this, you know, this data is based on figures. So, so overall, talk us through some of these Yeah, numbers. so the overall market, I mean, you're going to see 6.7 months of supply of inventory. We have seen a favored seller's market, and that seems like it's coming to an end right now, yet a balanced market is six months. So our market is still very healthy. Um, overall, you know, sales are down 12%. Prices are dipping about 7% from this quarter, year over year, the last quarter. The inventory levels are up about 7%. So the big ones are sales, inventory levels, median prices, and absorption rates, what we're looking at. Okay, yeah. all right, so let's take a deeper look now into Perfect. some of the, the specific markets. Now, the luxury market in Sarasota, now, this is defined as the top 10% of the market, so that puts us at just over $750,000. So pretty much, um, we, we're seeing about 14.7 months of supply of inventory. So that what that means is that if not another luxury house came on the market, it would take about 15 months for all those homes to sell which favors the buyers. There's a lot of inventory for buyers. So there's always two sides of the token. Mm -hmm. right. If you're a buyer in the luxury market, you have a lot to choose from right now. Okay. Yep. Uh, take us to the keys. Yeah, so the keys, this is Longo Key, Lido Key, Bird Key. It's similar story as it is in the luxury market. Sales are down 17%, while there's a, um, inventory is up a staggering 26% on the keys. So the buyers in the keys right now have a lot of the leverage. Okay. A lot of the leverage. It doesn't mean properties aren't selling. Properties mm -hmm. are absolutely selling. It's just, you know, okay. sellers are going to have to become a little bit more competitive. We always say out in the field, it's, you know, it's a beauty contest and a price war, right? Right. So, you know, <laughs> staging, photography, all the marketing really does matter more than ever at this point. All right. We've seen a lot of growth in downtown, a yeah. lot of building. What, what does this absolutely. mean now? So we, got, we have uh, almost 11% of our, I'm sorry, 11 months of supply of inventory downtown. So there were 189 sales this past quarter compared to 280 sales in the first quarter of 2018. So you've seen a drop in sales in there, um, although a lot of that is due in part of the new constructions. Last quarter we saw the view, we saw a lot of the big, oh, right. big new constructions close out. So that's what we've seen here. You can see median price point is 500. The Western Trail downtown is always going to be a very strong market. You can see in terms of the new construction out there and some of the new buildings out there as well. So strong market still favors the buyer. Central large area here. Yeah, this, this is a large largest. area. So you're going to see this is um, from I-75, so west of I-75, east of US-41. So overall, you're going to see the lowest levels of inventory across the market in this area, largely in part due to the, the price point you're going to see. Um, the market is still favoring sellers. So if you are a seller and you're located in that area, we're at 4.8 months of inventory, wow. which means that's a seller's market. It's a very strong price point there. Homes are selling quicker. There's a lot, a lot of demand, and again, that's the affordability in Interesting Sarasota. Interesting to see the variance in the different Absolutely. areas, and now also Lakewood Ranch. Definitely. In the east of so, and believe it or not, so east of I-75 in Lakewood Ranch is the largest year-over-year -year increase in prices. So there's a lot of positive news for sellers out here as well. Um, prices are up 15 percent okay. in this market, which is really great. Um, last year they were at 360,000 median price points, and now it's 416,000 is the median price point. So great market, very healthy, very balanced market. You're going to see 6.3 months of supply of inventory. Remember that six month mark is a balanced buyers and sellers market. So it's not all doom and gloom. Yeah. There are there are portions of the market that are still very, it's very great healthy. to have you break down these numbers yeah. for yeah. us rather than just look at the data on the screen. It. Now you did bring us some home. I did. I, get, I can't come here not bring any home. <laughs> okay, so this is Park Trace Estates. This is an Osprey. Beautiful home, brand new on the market. This is 475,000. Three bedrooms, three baths, 
plus a den, plus a bonus room over 2,500 square feet. Shows like a model. Um, I love the, it has a seamless transition. It has the uh, disappearing sliding glass door, so it's a great transition from the interior to the exterior. Tray ceilings you're going to see. Um, out in the back, they have a beautiful self-cleaning swimming pool, large fenced-in yard, um, and entertainment. So this is one of the biggest patios you can see. Multiple areas are perfect for entertaining, privacy, beautiful home, gorgeous community. Great price point at four hundred seventy-five thousand. All right, buy some other. Excellent. So these these are brand new construction. This is um just built this year. Nine hundred fifty thousand. This is an enclave of three new modern homes just um east of the trail. So an Arlington Park area, four bedrooms. This one specifically, four bedroom, four bath, over twenty-five hundred square feet. Um, this was uh, designed by the award-winning architect Mark Sultana. Um, you're going to see polished concrete floors. Hardwood engineered, solid core doors, commercial grade roof, impact glass, cascading towards countertops. There are multiple um, balconies here overlooking uh, the beautiful area back there. Yeah, drive by this one. I love a lot. Have Sometimes. you seen this one? Yeah, yeah. just a couple blocks. And from actually brought us a dream Absolutely, home. yeah, absolutely. This is on the keys, though. This is Longo Key. Love this property. Look at this. One point four million dollars. Yes, that is the Gulf of Mexico right there behind you. A short walk. Um, three bedrooms, three baths. Over 2,600 square feet. This is perfect to live in year-round or rent out. Um, huge property. Um, Award-winning community development of the year. This is Conrad Beach. Um, so this was voted number one community by Coastal Living Magazine, which is really cool. This property specifically, though, was designed and occupied by the legendary architect Frank Folsom um, Smith. So uh, anyway, great property here. Shows like a model. It backs right up to the community. So, uh, and so. thank you for bringing down welcome. the, the report <laughs> for us and for these beautiful homes. For more information about these homes and many others, you can contact Andrew at sellingthesuncoast.com. Don't go away. We'll be right back.